are watching Judge My Barbecue. Was that good, Dad? Good morning. It is morning. It's a whole new day. Welcome to Judge My Barbecue. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. It's not going to be uh, like you've seen in the past. We're going to go head to head. We have six different species of pork ribs here. And what we're going to do is we're going to season them all the same. We're going to trim them all the same. Smoke them all the same. To tenderness. Some a little bit thicker than others. So when they're ready, as they're ready, we will pull them and then we're going to have a judging and we're going to see what species we like the best. Now we're going to start over here with our number one entry. This is this is Duroc pork. Uh, the next one here is Iberico. Iberico is a species from Spain. Uh, Spain. Uh, next one is Berkshire pork. It's a, a, a strain that comes from uh, Great Britain. And over here we have a control. This is an American pork that you can get at your local supermarket. Next one is uh, Red Wattle. We have Red Wattle and then we have Cheshire. So six different species and once you season them and start cooking them, they're all going to look the same. So what we do is we have a little, you'll notice there's toothpicks in each one and that's a code that I'm using so that I know one strain from the other. And when they're all done, what we're going to do is we're going to sit down and we're going to uh, eat each one and we're going to grade them and we're going to come up with a chart and you'll see all of that uh, as far as the results. You're not going to see people eating because there's lots of other videos with people eating wonderful food. You don't need to see that on this one. So next time you see us we'll be out at the grill. Everything will be prepped and ready to go. Thank you. As you can tell we're out at the judge now. We're at the smoker. We've got it up to temp. We've got a nice clean burn going here. You can barely see any smoke. That's indicative of a nice clean burn. Here we have our racks. Now what I've done is I arranged them in order of uh, thickness. The thickest ones closest to the firebox. Hopefully we'll try to gauge them as we go along and uh, as, as we need uh, we will move them around so that they all hopefully finish at the same time because that's what everybody wants. Don't have to want to wait for anything. So we're going to close this up and uh, we're going to let it do its thing and I'll come out a couple times in the next few hours and then uh, we'll pull them and we'll do some judging. All right, all right, we'll catch you later. Okay, so we're getting to the home stretch now. Uh, as predicted, each of the thicknesses of uh, these pork ribs cook at a different rate. So this is the last one uh, It's nice and flexible now. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put it in the aluminum foil wrap. We're gonna take the uh, Judge My Barbecue Spritzer and put down, this is just plain water, this is just for moisture and we're going to take the ribs and we're going to watch out for the toothpicks so we don't puncture the aluminum foil and we're just going to wrap it up and we're going to put it in the oven and it's going to steam for us for a little while and then uh, we'll go to the judging and we'll see what happens with that all right so we'll catch you with the results of the judging see you in a while so here we are we're getting to the end as you can see we have a whole variety of pork here. Some thick, some thin, a little bit of a challenge to keep uh, cooking at the same rate, uh, but we're there. And for your edification, I have labels on all of these, uh, but after we're done, then I'm gonna bring my judges in and we're gonna remove all these and we're gonna come back with the results of this cook. So. Uh, as I said, this is not a, a cooking uh, demonstration today, but a preference on species of pork. So that's it for now, and maybe cameraman can zoom in to the different species and see what we have here. After a long deliberation, we have a clear-cut winner, and we had, uh, like I say, a lot of discussion about what place was first and what was last. Uh, last place was simple. We're going to go down and look at our findings here. Our first place was Berkshire. We had a unanimous decision on that. Uh, second, which was my personal favorite, the Red Wattle. Uh, a surprise, uh, Duroc was uh, kind of disappointing. Cheshire also was disappointing. Uh, I think the m biggest disappointment was the Iberco. Uh, the Iberco just didn't have it today. And then of course, everyone 
unanimous decided that uh, supermarket was the least of our favorite of different porks. So the next competition, I'm going to focus on Berkshire and uh, bring hope, like uh, get a call for number one. All right, so that's it for this week. Uh, we still have to decide what we're going to be doing for our next video, but uh, thanks for joining us. Now, don't forget, I need you to like and subscribe, and that'll really help uh, my whole uh, activity here. And we'll see you next time on Judge My Barbecue.